Hello everyone, my name is Adam Rootsgarn de Camp, and I'm the lead writer for Unrest, an ancient Indian role-playing game. Now, I've been playing a lot of RPGs since I was seven years old, both computer and tabletop, and there's a few things I've noticed in this time. The first is, the most fun you can have in an RPG is when the game recognizes what you're trying to do with your character, and incorporates that into the narrative, when it acknowledges the choices you're making. The second thing is that a lot of them are set in medieval Europe, with Americans doing British accents. Number one is the setting. Unrest is set in ancient India, and it's amazing how starting from a new set of myths and historical contexts influences everything in the story writing process, and gives the whole thing a very refreshing feel. Number two is no fail states, just failures. Horrible, catastrophic failures. Now, there are three main chapters, and in each one you play a different character. Different characters with different hopes and dreams and aspirations. And whether they succeed, or fail, or give up, or change their mind, or die, that becomes part of the storyline. That becomes the narrative that's passed on to the next chapter. So on the one hand, the story continues no matter what. But on the other hand, the risks you choose to take have real significance. And number three, combat serves the story. It doesn't pat it. Now, Unrest does have a combat system, based off the fencing simulation of the original Sid Meier's Pirates, but every combat in the game is avoidable. And whenever you are fighting someone, you know who they are and why they're fighting you. You're not going to have to kill a thousand faceless, agendaless, no-surrender hobos before you can get to the next bit of storyline. Now, sometimes choosing violence may solve all your problems. Sometimes it may create problems you never expected. And sometimes you screw up, your character dies, and that's where their story ends but it's always your choice. Now, to make this game everything it can be, we're going to need your help. Please, look to the right and consider the donation incentives. Thanks for watching. Hi there. Apologies if I look like hell, but it's like 45 degrees here and we get power cuts all the time. Anyway, I'm Arvind, head of Pyrodactyl Games. I've been programming games for about six years now. I just wanted to make a sincere appeal to you. Please consider backing our project on Kickstarter and helping us make the game of our dreams. Thanks for watching.